Good morning. This is our 2 kilowatt system in Alasia. Uh, right now, Nepa is producing ridiculously low current, so low that in fact our inverter does not see it. Okay, so we're running on, actually Nepa is producing 119 volts. So we're running off solar right now. Okay, as you could see, this is a 2 kilowatt inverter. That is um, our charge controller. This is our charge controller. We have two 200 amp hour batteries and here is our here is our inverter as you can see as you, this updates give it a second let's see if we can focus properly you see the readings it says welcome abnormal voltage 117 coming from nepa load right now is 19 percent we're in inverter mode and you see 117 volts coming from nepa 221 is what we're producing and the batteries are 25.4 volts if you see the fridge the lights are on in the fridge we have our voltage stabilizer as you see the light is on okay let me go turn the TV on so you can see here let me turn the fan on light and let me turn on the TV if the TV is plugged in as you know in Nigeria you unplug everything so the cable is plugged in the antenna is plugged in so let's turn the TV on you can hear the fan well the cable, the cable is plugged in I don't know why the TV is not plugged in this is the TV this is the cable that's the antenna. As you can see, everything is plugged in. Okay, the TV is on right now. So we're going to change here. This morning we turned on the water pump. We'll go back and I'll see what the load says we're carrying right now. Before it was 19%, now we've put the water pump on, we've put the fan on, we've put our additional light on, and we'll see what the load says it is. So, abnormal, we still have 117 coming from Nepa, 25.4 volts, so it's not even doing anything to the batteries right now. 117 volts, we're producing 219 and we're 27% load. We'll go outside, so you see it's a really cloudy day, but our panels are still producing electricity, and I'll use a tester and show you how many volts. This is a very cloudy day. Okay, very, very cloudy day. So we have NEPA, but NEPA voltage is too low to power our, our to power whatever we have. So here's our tester, and here's our charge controller. And I'm going to plug it into the charge controller to see what is coming, okay? So here's our testing uh, multimeter. By the way, this is not the way the final installation is going to look. We're going to mount it on this wall, okay? Come on in. We're going to mount it on this wall. And then what will happen is we will tidy up the connections, clean up the wiring so people don't see it. So, as they come, hold this camera for me, I beg. Point it to this for me. It's, it's on, I'm recording, so point it to this so we can see what's going on here, okay? Actually, point it to what I'm doing here first. So here's voltage. Here is a voltage from our, our solar panels. Overload. Oops. DC. So point, point it to the meter. Point it to the meter. Can you see very close? Can you see what it says? 29.3 volts. So even though it's very cloudy, we're getting 29.3 volts. Our panels are 34 volt panels. Okay, our, our 34 volt panels. So we're producing close to full power. So right now we're producing enough electricity from the panels to power the house. And we're running at 26% load with everything on, including the fridge, the lights. Okay, our NEPA now is producing 124 volts. So that's it.